Welcome back. You are tuned into your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso right here on your home S3. It's wonderful to be in your company. We are talking vision boards, everything that goes with it for this year. It's a brand new one, 2024. Now, vision boards, we know they are, they're literally dream maps and they are, they're, they're really fun ways to paint a picture of your future goals and wishes. And they help us see clearly what we're aiming for and cheer us on to go and get it. Now, we're going to dive into it for some simple, exciting goals. And uh, Zoe has got her vision board to share with us this morning Zoe. Yes, you know what, this was quite exciting because we were in on honeymoon in Australia and one morning we just did a sunrise at Bondi Beach and we created our vision goals for the year mm -hmm. and then obviously when we got home we did the vision board. It's not a bad place so, to create a vision I board. I mean, come on, <laughs> I've seen worse. Beautiful, quiet, sunrise. Oh, yeah, so one yeah, of yeah. the first things I did say I wanted to do was I want to stop overbooking myself mm. and you know feel like you're rushing from one mm. thing to the other. Yeah. So a goal of mine is to literally just do one thing at a time. Love to that. not overbook and really just keep it a little bit more of a a slower pace. Mm. I think that whole rushing and constantly being busy, it's not something I, I not strive for yeah. anymore. Mm. And it's just, it's, it's quite nice and refreshing to mm. just do one thing at a time. Yeah. So that's top of my Ooh, vision board. Okay. That the second thing that I've added was just to be a little bit more realistic with my fitness goals. Mm -hmm. I think it's so easy to say, I want to exercise five, six days a week. But reality is with our schedules, it's not always possible. Yeah. And then you yeah. end up feeling guilty. Mm -hmm. So on my goals list is if I can hit three days a week, max five days a week, then I am happy. Yeah. So it could be Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Yeah. It could be Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, nice. Sunday, whatever mm. it is. I want to be pacing myself mm. with regards to... And getting that consistency. Mm. I mean, even if that's it's three to important. five, I mean, that's a good goal. Yeah, that's one of the big ones. Yeah. Something I would love to get back into is a little bit of running. So yes. running is on my vision board. It's on the goals. Um, and that's also just to slowly get back into it. Mm -hmm. Doing a marathon, training for that that I did in such a short space of time, yeah. it was incredible, but mm. I think I had like PTSD of yeah, sure. doing it I'm from sure. zero yeah. to yeah. hero in 12, 13 weeks. So but it's I, only Zoe that will do that. Yeah. Go from zero to 100. Let's, now let's run a marathon. Okay, let's do it. Let's go. I do want to get back into it for shorter distances. <laughs> for not, sure, not, we'll not build 42. it up. Build yeah. it up. <laughs> we'll nice. build up to that. And then one thing I find that whenever I reach that point, like one of the things on my goals list is to declutter the garage. Ooh. Because the garage is where everything gets chucked out to. <laughs> and then it stands there and then it's just, yeah, yeah. that is a big thing yeah. for me is no, to declutter listen, the garage. Let me tell you, there's no better feeling uh. than knowing that your garage is sorted. I Thick know. Span. Marie yes. Kondo, the hell out of that. It's like, <laughs> what doesn't spark joy needs to go. Yes, <laughs> yes, I might need help to get stuff out. I like that, what doesn't spark joy. Okay, oh. cool. And the final thing that I've decided, I can't say I've decided, so I saw my sister with Christmas and it was really special. We haven't seen each other in three years. And we oh. just decided that was way too long. We want to do Christmas together, but we want to do a white Christmas. So Ooh. we are all getting very excited to do a white Christmas, all the siblings together. Ooh. Beautiful. Okay, okay. Yeah. And oh, yes, something I really want to do because now that I have a bit more free time, mm. not being on radio every mm. afternoon, I do want to upskill myself with Lovely. something. And I think a marketing course is something I'm going to look into, perhaps something else, but I do feel like I need to upskill myself. Mm. Yeah. I love okay. it for you. I would yeah. suggest digital marketing because that's marketing. The yeah. 100%. Yeah. 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 That's exciting. Yeah. 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 Thank exciting. you for sharing. <laughs> but I mean, this is exciting. What about you? Oh my goodness, do I go into detail? Yeah. Do we, I we, we play all my cards? Share, but, I mean, but I mean, if you realistically, <laughs> yeah. I mean, we're looking forward. 2023 was mm. a tough year, let's it be was. honest. It, really it was, was a tough year yeah. for many, many people. I think time was, was very difficult mm. for a lot of people. We ran around like crazy. Yeah. But now I can feel that we're gearing up for a good yes. year. And I'm speaking that into existence Please. right now. It's on my vision board. Yes. <laughs> so, so what's happening on your side? I think that 2023 was definitely prep for what 2024 was going to be about, right? And uh, a couple of goals that I didn't quite take off last year being carried over so DJing being one of them Ooh. so I've got the basics down it's just about the confidence to get out there because DJing is really hard right you are the crowd pleaser the vibe creator so I don't want to take that too lightly that's definitely something I'm going into and then just going bigger and better in my career uh, mm. across TV across radio also online on social mm. media uh, just making sure there's beautiful yeah. consistency throughout and synergy across all three of those different platforms uh, I also definitely want to show up as a better door as a better Aww. fiance, 
fiance and hopefully wife by the end of this year. <laughs> um, and just as a better friend. So those are definitely some of my interpersonal and also career goals that I'm like definitely that. striving for. Oh, awesome. Well, thanks for I, I feel like I need to say uh, we do not have have a baby on 2024's <clears throat> goal list. That will be next year. I did Thank say we Zoe. want to be married at least a year. Okay. So Before. aunties, please don't ask me when the baby's coming. I just got married. I want to be married for a year. You know how please it goes. Please don't ask. <laughs> yeah. At every family gathering. I know. Yeah, cool. Zoe, thank you very much. You can thank go you. gear up for your news. I'll thank you. That. Carissa, thank you very thank much. You. So, so Zoe was very forthcoming with her yeah. vision board. Let's quickly take a look at some of those slides once again. Sure. We can see there, um, you know, there we go. One task at a time. She says exercise, get consistency in there mm. she wants to start running a white christmas in europe listen that's a that's a liquor one yeah. uh, to declutter the home or the garage and uh, get into a little bit of upskilling mm -hmm. herself some marketing Beautiful. i love that very very cool all right so um i've also got one i was gonna ask can yeah, you share yeah. yours we've no, been no, putting out i wasn't the just table. asking i've got one and i will share some of what's on my vision board and carissa is not going anywhere because we'll have some golden globes to chat about we do very exciting and there's a, a lot to talk about mm -hmm. for sure yeah. <laughs> right now let's get into some news